The Earth is full of mysteries, and no place on the planet is more mysterious than the bottom of the oceans. It's an inhospitable environment, which is difficult to explore. Some divers have tried their level best to bring to light the life in these depths, but there's much more to see and discover. Today, we take a look at some of the amazing wildlife that divers discovered in the very depths of the ocean, and how they've adapted to the harsh conditions there. Let's begin! Number 13. Giant Phantom Jellyfish Well, when we discuss phantoms and giants, automatically images of fictitious characters crop up in our minds. But sea divers and researchers from Mbari have observed a very rare giant phantom jellyfish. They discovered this huge jellyfish at 3,200 feet below sea level. That is just too deep for any diver as well. This is why they relied upon a remote-eyed submarine. They described the ghostly giant as a rare sight. Some of the ribbon-like oral arms can grow more than a whopping 33 feet in length. It glows like an orange gumdrop, and the creature looks like a hat surrounded by flowing scarves. The huge giant also uses its mouth arms to trap its prey and eat it. But a truly horrid fact is that those same mouth arms also function as the jellyfish's anus. Number 12. Dumbo Octopus – A Mariana Trench the Mariana Trench is the deepest underwater point in the world, at 36,201 feet, and is the home to the Dumbo octopus. The octopus does not look scary at all, and is 8 to 12 inches long. They are quite charming in nature, but to their prey, they are just quick killers who swallow them whole in a gulp. They are called Dumbo because their ear-like fins resemble the ears of the popular Disney character Dumbo, the flying elephant. This octopus species has a distinct mouth structure, which allows them to swallow prey whole instead of tearing and chewing. Their color variety allows them to easily camouflage with the environment. However, unlike other octopuses, they do not have any ink sac. Number 11. Lost City of Heraclean The deep sea is not just filled with amazing creatures, but also has some of the most legendary cities that were lost in time. This is the ancient city of Heraclean, near Alexandria in Egypt. The divers have managed to exhume this lost city from the Ocenic Depths. They found a massive temple to God among Garab, a large number of gold coins, 16 feet tall statues, 64 ships, 700 anchors, etc. It is believed that in the ancient era, this city was one of the greatest pharaonic cities. Most experts also claim that the city was known by two names. The Egyptians called it Thanis, while ancient Greeks called it Heraclean. Not much is known as to how the city went underwater. The most common explanation is that during a great flood, the soil made of solid clay quickly turned into liquid and submerged all the city below the water level. Number 10. Headless Chicken Monster The surprising fact about headless chicken monsters is that they are neither chicken nor headless, but do look like monsters. This sea cucumber species was found in the 1880s, but was finally photographed in 2017. This particular species doesn't really have a brain or sensory organs. Although named monsters, these creatures are pretty harmless. Headless chickens are semi-transparent, and you can see their intestines. They can sometimes emit their own light, and their body is strangely shaped. Highly active, the headless chicken plays a crucial role in filtering sediment from the ocean floor. Number 9. Train Graveyard in New Jersey A train graveyard underwater? Sounds like some horror movie. Check this out, a train graveyard was found just off the coast of New Jersey, with trains from the 1850s. The huge metal objects were first discovered by Paul Hepler in 1985, with the help of a magnetometer. Initially, he did not suspect something as large as a train, and can you blame him? What's even more shocking is that these trains were rare even in the 1850s, and quickly became obsolete right after their production. But how did they sink? Surprisingly, there are no historical records of them being lost, but the mysterious nature of this discovery doesn't end there. No record exists as to how these engines were built, perhaps due to some major accident records were lost, or they never existed at all. However, despite being in the water for over 160 years, the locomotive parts remain remarkably well preserved. Number 8. Christmas Tree Worms Christmas tree worms are simply as fascinating as their name suggests. They are basically a common name for marine worms that inhabit the coral reefs around the world. They look like brightly colored crowns and have a protruding body. These crowns have hair-like appendages that extend from the worm's central spine. 
They do not like to move much and mostly settle for life once they find their place. However, when they feel threatened, they quickly retract and hide themselves in the sea burrows. As far as diet goes, these tree worms usually trap their prey and eat them immediately. They mostly prey on phytoplankton, zooplankton, and detritus particles. Number 7. Frilled Shark The deep sea is home to some of the most frightening creatures. Yes, in the past, they were called sea monsters. The most common alleged sea monster is none other than the scary-looking frilled shark. It spends most of its time in the deep dark waters, which is why people have rarely encountered one in its habitat. It can reach up to 7 feet and has fins on its far backside. These sharks have 25 rows of teeth in their jaws. Instead of tearing apart its prey, frilled sharks are known to swallow the captured animal whole. Also, even though these are classified as sharks, they swim more like eels. You never want to encounter one of these scary-looking underwater monsters during your dive. An Australian fisherman accidentally caught a frilled shark and was just horrified, and we really can't blame him. Number 6. Stonefish Well, many creatures in the deep sea are undoubtedly scary. While some simply look terrifying, others have dangerous features and abilities. For instance, meet the stonefish. It is the most venomous fish in the world. Experts believe that through its dorsal fin, this fish can inject a venom that is capable of killing adults within an hour. This scary stonefish does not use its venom to capture prey. They use it mostly to strike at intruders. The venom causes extreme pain and is very effective to turn away even the strongest predators. What makes stonefish even more dangerous is the fact that they are masters of camouflage. Their colors are often a perfect match for the surrounding stones. How can someone avoid an animal they can't even see? If that wasn't enough, there is more to this underwater creature. Stonefish, despite their name, are extremely agile, being able to catch and consume their prey in 0.0015 seconds. Number 5. Ancient Greek Computer When we think of computers, we normally do not associate the world ancient with it. The reason is quite simple. Computers never existed in ancient times. But hold your horses, the underwater world says otherwise. In 1901, sea divers discovered the extraordinary Antikythera ancient Greek computer. The device is believed to be over 2,000 years old. It is often called the first computer by the explorers. Many researchers believe that this device was primarily used to predict astronomical events, such as solar and lunar eclipses. But how the device functions has remained a mystery to most. It looks like a mantle clock. A team of researchers from the University College London has proposed a mechanism to uncover its mysteries. What is more interesting about this computer is that it proves that the Greeks believe that the Earth is the center of the universe. Now, attempts are being made to see whether the model that they made back then can be replicated today. Number 4. Colossal Squid This is another horrifying creature of the deep seas. The colossal squid is a massive underwater animal that mainly lives in Antarctica and has many records to its name. It is the largest invertebrate species on Earth. It has the largest eyes of any living being, and even the eyes of whales are smaller compared to theirs. It is because of their eyes that they can spot both their prey and their predator from a distance of 120 meters. But how big is it really? Well, it can grow up to 46 feet long and weigh more than 500 kilos. It is a terror to many fish species because it actively kills fish, irrespective of their size. Their tentacles are coated with suckers and have sharp hooks to destroy their prey before they can even react. But despite these scary features, sperm whales commonly target and eat them. Though adult colossal squids can hit back and injure them, younger squids have little chance. Number 3. Anglerfish Now let's take a look at a fish that is as terrifying as a horror movie villain. Meet the anglerfish. This fish looks like a glowing piece of flesh armed with several needle-like teeth. The fin on their foreheads resemble a fishing hook and it's designed to attract prey. Once their prey comes near them, they quickly gulp them down in an instant. But the truly scariest features of this fish are the sharp fang-like teeth. At one point in time, due to their devil-like appearance, they were called common black devils. They inhabit the deepest parts of the oceans often reaching depths of up to 3,000 feet, and have a unique light-producing organ called a photophore. Although this scary creature cannot swim fast, its spine is highly flexible and can move in any direction. 
Number 2. Coelacanth, the last remaining Lazarus species. Seas are filled with prehistoric creatures, and this next fish is living proof of that. This is the coelacanth. It has a lineage spanning more than 360 million years. Coelacanth was thought to have gone extinct until one was caught alive off the South African coast in 1938. These fish can reach lengths of up to 6 feet and weigh around 200 pounds. They look heavily armored and are quite hostile too. Marine biologists believe that this fish species can be ancestors of tetrapods. Their jaws are quite unique as they have hinges for wider openings. No other fish has an intracranial joint like the coelacanth. That's why it can open its mouth wide enough to gulp prey down. They also have a notochord and do not have any backbones. These features do not exist in other fish species. This fish also has a pretty good lifespan at around 60 years. A second species of coelacanth, the Latimeria menandoensis, was discovered in 1997. Number 1. Flying Grenard Not all creatures in the sea are mysterious. Some are just incredibly beautiful to look at. The most prominent example is the Flying Grenard, which is found abundantly in the Atlantic Ocean and Mediterranean Sea. The most eye-catching feature of the fish is its wingspan, which are actually its pectoral fins. The transparency of the fins, combined with the color of the blue spots, makes these fish look as if they are flying in the water. Their fins don't really help them swim. Instead, they just allow for short bursts of movements. While moving in the water, their swim bladders make a grunting sound. There are thousands of other creatures underwater that would surely induce nightmares. But that's all for today. Tell us if you know of some other scary deep sea creature. Also, in case you are interested in such videos, then do subscribe and press the bell icon for more notifications. May you have a great day and we hope to see you again in another thrilling video.